Hello, Collectivity Girl Monica. We'll get the Tarot 777 here today to do you guys' reading. It's just a bonus reading. I'm just throwing a couple of readings out there for you guys as my way of saying thank you. Thank you for liking, sharing, and subscribing. I really appreciate you. And it helps me to uh, gravitate towards your energy. So thank you so much. Let's get started. All right, I hope you guys are doing good. Give me one moment here, guys. One moment here. Give me a few moments here. Just a few moments. Thank you. I gotta get something out of my purse real quick. Some lotion on my hands they've been really dry you guys skin has it been dry lately you've been keeping your hands clean i can tell because my hands they clean but they dry as hell damn but they clean i'll tell you that oh man feel some relief you guys are getting some relief going on is that's what's going on? I feel like somebody's getting some relief here. Things are starting to look a little bit more shiny. A little bit more ripe for you guys. Mm-hmm. That's what I think. I get that. Mm hmm You guys are chill. Cool now. Hmm. Somebody with the letter S, somebody with the letter M, P, or T. Could be N2. Mm -hmm. If not, you got E A R in your name. Or I. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. This is for you. I'm going to get my hands ready for you. <laughs> thank you, Spirit. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, Holy Spirit. What are the messages here for the collective? What is it that they need to know? Can I get the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth? Please use me as a vessel to give me clear, cut, conscious messages to my viewers, my subscribers, especially. And even the karmics and my enemies, mostly. Jesus name we pray, amen. Let's get started. Okay, Holy Spirit, Angel, Ancestor, guys, what messages would you like for me to bring? What are the messages, please? May I have the messages here from my collective. Mm. To the goddess and the gods. This is a Virgo. Do I have Virgo in your chart? Hmm. Okay. Well, we'll see. What's going on to the gods and the goddesses? The gods and the goddesses. Mm. Take action. Hmm. There should be someone with fire in your chart. Mm, this is a Gemini. That's taking action. Hmm. I can see that. Yeah, they have fire in their chart. They could be enthusiastic, gentle, outgoing, charming. This Gemini is taking action. Ooh, ghosts. What is the, going on with this? Mm. Gods and the goddesses. I want in the spiritual world. Can this be like a grandparent, parent? Grandparent or parent, I feel like, for some of y'all. Mm, they're talking to you guys, telling you guys to take action. To get out there. Mm-hmm. Could be with a Virgo. Could be a Virgo who's um, passed on. And, and who's trying to tell you to take action. This person could be a grandmother. This person could be um, Gemini and Virgo in their chart. Telling you to take action is what the main message is. 
What are they needing to take action on, Spirit? A breakup. Hmm. Ooh, what's going on, Spirit? A breakup. A painful ending in one. Mm, mm, mm. What are y'all doing? Just sitting there? Oh, something that ended? Ghost? An ending? A painful ending that you need to take action now that things are over. You may not be... You may not be going out. You may not be as charming. You may not be as gentle as you are, as enthusiastic with hanging out. Because mm -mm. it's painful ending. Could have been with um, a divine, feminine. Mm, someone who's passionate, brave, faithful, intuitive, ambitious, and focused. Supposed to, this person stood up. This person was a stand-up type of person, very faithful, yeah. And that's what's so painful about it. Something ended with this person. And someone's needing to take action if they want to come back towards this person. Ooh, because this was unconditional love that someone had. This could be a twin flame. This was someone that they were compatible with. They looked at this person as a goddess. Mm. Mm. But there was someone here that was determined to break this up. Mm -hmm. They weren't honest. Mm -hmm. They were determined to break this up. They had the strength, the determination, confidence to cause this breakup secretly. Ghost. Mm. I use common sense. Yes, yeah, spirit. Somebody was doing black magic is what I feel spirit is trying to say. Some evilness caused this breakup. Mm-hmm. Get on. They got on someone's last nerve. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Spirit. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm closing this. Last card was a Sagittarius. This person could have had Sagittarius in their chart. For some of you, this person may have gotten on your last nerve. Mm -hmm. There may have been a lot of arguments between you two. Mm -hmm. Scorpio and a Virgo. Yeah, there was some spirit over here that caused some type of breakup. Could have been a Leo. And a Leo in their chart. Mm -hmm. Someone wasn't using, listening to spirit when spirit was talking to them. This Gemini, the one who has this unconditional love for this Virgo. There's another story here. Mm -hmm. This person is Virgo and Scorpio. Mm -hmm. A goddess, a god. Mm -hmm. I got water and earth in their chart. And your person has air. Could be air and um, water. And the person that broke this up has fire. Has fire and they're compatible with Virgo. Mm -hmm. Yeah, their spirit try to come in like they're this goddess. They got an evil spirit to them. This person has an evil fucking spirit that makes people compatible to them. Mm -hmm. She comes off real gentle, real outgoing and charming. 
like she's going to provide this unconditional love. But this spirit that she carries is there to cause painful fucking endings. Mm hmm Yeah, she wanted to cause a painful ending for someone who's a white snake. Their name can have a letter S in it. The person that was um trying to cause this this person's painful ending can have the letter S in their name. They was trying to passionately cause this type of ending, some painful ending, but the white snake always win. They were brave enough, faithful enough when they came to spirit and caused the ending. Yeah, painful one for the one that was determined, the courageous, the Leo here. You know, somebody who got the name L, got a letter L in their name. Mm. The one that wanted to break this person up because they said that they got on their last nerve. Something that, something that the white snake did to this, this person with the letter L in their name, fire sign. That caused them to take action and break up this relationship. Mm-hmm. That's exactly what's going on here. That's exactly what's going on here. Let's pull the other cards. Yeah, but someone still has love even after everything. Because their love for them is unconditional. Mm-hmm. Yep. Someone's wanting to take action after this painful ending. Mm-hmm. They're real enthusiastic. Gemini and Scorpio is together. Uh, Aaliyah is trying to break it up. I'm trying to send evil spirit. Could it be a Gemini trying to send it to a Leo or a Leo trying to send it to a Gemini? Mm -hmm. This Virgo is the one that's compatible between them all. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. That could be who left them, broke up with them. She may have felt more compatible towards the Leo than she was with the uh, Gemini. Gemini may have caused a painful ending. So this Virgo left. Virgo's, this, this Virgo may have Gemini. She's very enthusiastic. She moved forward. Very gentle. Love. Outgoing. She's very loving. That's for sure. Unconditional love. Compatible with a lot of friends. She's a queen. An empress. A god, a goddess, male or female. You're having some breakup. Someone caused some type of breakup in your family over here. Could be a Sagittarius. Wow. That's probably why I put that down so fast and then picked it back up. Yeah, Sagittarius could have caused this ill. Mm -hmm, some imbalance. This is who caused it. Or Sagittarius and caused, caused the imbalance. Hopefully that helps you to clarify as to what's going on with whom and what. This could be towards a Sagittarius. Mm -hmm. Let me see. What about the Sagittarius? It was quickly doing what? I miss you. I love you to death. Oh, shit. Yup. This is the Sagittarius. Hey, someone did this to the Sagittarius. They, they got Sagittarius. Mm -hmm. I love you to death. This is unconditional love right here. And this Sagittarius, yeah, this is who this is. Grandpa. Could be a dad, baby dad. This is an old love, someone that they grew old with. Someone who made them happy. Whatever I feel, you feel. This is a twin flame, I already said that. Can we talk, please? This is someone, this Sagittarius is not talking to them. Mm -hmm. As much as they're compatible, well, I'm not talking to them. Mm -hmm. I think that's enough, y'all. Are you my soulmate? Mm -hmm. who, they, who else is they talking about? There's two people here. I already said that. All right, it's time to get started. I had a dream about you last night. Mm -hmm. What was that dream about? 
I betrayed you with another woman. Oh, shit. How come Sagittarius is... I be reading y'all minds. Maybe the... Oh, shit. This is the Sagittarius that betrayed you. Oh, shit. Dream minds. Thank you, spirit. You done leveled me up, huh? That's why you had me doing all these cards like this. Wow, whatever you feel, I feel. Wow. Because they, they had a dream that they betrayed you with another woman. And I feel comfort when I'm with you. That's definitely um an unconditional love. Karmic lesson learned. Oh, shit. We bet. We bet. God damn it. <laughs> yeah, we bet you learned your goddamn lesson. That shit was a painful fucking ending, whatever the fuck went on over here. Shit was painful as fuck for some goddamn body. <laughs> Somebody went through some shit. But this motherfucker was determined to make sure they was confident, they was courageous, the fuck had the strength, they was. Some of they were honest. What was it? It was some honesty, some truth that hurt they as says this is did. Yeah, this is the tarot truth. So the truth must have hurt. There was some honesty that came in that hurt this person. Yeah, calls this motherfucker to take some fucking action here. Passionately they fucking took some goddamn action. They were thinking long and hard, focus on this goddamn shit with breaking up some goddamn body here. Whatever they did, you know, somebody learned a fucking lesson. Mm hmm. For some of y'all, y'all person and you are both Sagittarius. Well, somebody got it in a chart and somebody's a Sagittarius, son. Good damn. Will you ever forgive me? Boo, babe, bae. Somebody calls you boo, babe, or bae. Damn, they are lost, sad. They like, will you ever forgive me? They done learned a fucking lesson. Hell, I don't know what to tell you. I'm just your friend, friend. Friend, I don't know what to tell you, friend. I don't know what to tell you, friend, but somebody, they got unconditional love over here. They saying like they feel, you know, comfort when they with you. They said they had this dream now. Now they want to come and tell you about the fucking dream now. I guess that whatever the fuck that dream was. That dream done woke they ass up. They done got all these damn illusions. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the illusion of them thinking that they had other fucking soulmates around here. Spirit showed them what the hell was going on in this situation. Now they want to talk to you. They want to know why you're going to forgive them. This Sagittarius. Mm -hmm. Quickly, quickly thinking of a way on how they're going to talk to you. How you going to forgive them because they miss you. I can love you to death. This is definitely a soulmate right here. Somebody they want to grow old. This is somebody that you've been with for a long time. Grandpa, somebody old. Somebody you've been with for a long fucking time here. That's why whatever you feel, they feel. Because this is a soulmate energy. They make you fucking happy. You make them damn happy forever. Look old. Look at this. They want forever with your eyes. You see that eight in there? If your eyes can visualize. If you. I'm, I'm telling y'all. Some of y'all. This could be. This Leo right here. But then again, this fucking spirit is right here with this eight. Let me know. Like some Leo may have put something on it. Some Leo may have done something to cause somebody's happiness. To disturb someone's happiness. Try to get in the way of a divine true love over here. Oh, y'all. We got the tea. Ooh, we got that tea. We got that real tea. They quickly trying to haul ass back. You could have quickly cut they ass off. Not talking to they ass in this damn situation. You ain't talking to they ass. Hell yeah. Because they betrayed you. Damn, Sagittarius. Every time I think of something, y'all already... Because <sighs> they betrayed you. And you know it. That's what them clouds is. You know it. Mm. There's someone else that they thought was their soulmate. Mm -mm -mm. A fucking bitch. Someone that they thought would make them happy, a wish fulfillment. Someone that they thought would be complete with, would bring them joy, would bring them bliss. They didn't get that. They got some illusions. Mm -hmm. Put these down, y'all. Let's get to the rest of the reading over here. But that's what the hell. Seems like something's going on with some Sagittarius, a Leo, a Gemini. Uh, I see uh, Scorpio's down here on the board. Take action. That's definitely Leo right here. 
the goddess is a Virgo right here. Spirit, air, that's definitely Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, and that's to clarify that. Unconditional love. Love is on the board. That could be a water sign right here. Mm. Ooh, somebody was a karmic because it came out in reverse. Uh, somebody was a, somebody was a karmic. Somebody somebody took a loss. This is what the fuck the painful ending was. Mm, they damn sure did because when I picked it up, I did this. Oh yeah, that's right. To y'all, I showed y'all like this, but to me, it's upside down because that's the way I picked it up. So yeah, okay, I wanted to make sure because if it was a karmic, but someone was a karmic in the past and now they could be coming in. Ooh, this karmic may have taken a loss. They tell me I'm a karmic and I know it was. Since you know, you should know that what the fuck is coming to your ass as Karmicville. Someone's coming out of Karmicville. Mm. Yeah, someone's coming out of taking losses. Someone took a big loss here. They may be coming out of it. They may have learned their lesson. That's why they're coming out of Karmicville. Mm. That's what's going on. Somebody came out of Karmicville because they learned their goddamn lesson. Mm. You heard this. Somebody got their feelings hurt in this shit. Somebody from the past or somebody right now currently has their goddamn feelings hurt. They are painful, crying, damn pain. But that was in this deck. So it tells me whatever happened to you has now happened to this person, which is coming out. And that's why he's probably trying to come into you guys. Let's keep going. That's what I get, but we about to see. I want to keep going with my deck, but... I know people don't be believing in, you know, stuff, so we'll just use these. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> yeah, we got this Leo right here. I already said that. Leo is what caused this change, this breakup. We already said that. This eight that I saw, we already said that. But nobody don't want to believe my damn deck. They just think my damn deck some colors on a goddamn black piece of paper. Okay, well, we'll use these. These shit got more pictures in it anyway. I can clarify more using this shit, okay? That's what we're gonna do. Somebody bit this motherfucking lion Leo's hand. That's why this Leo became spiteful over here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yep, someone who is spiritual. Look all the white. I try to tell you. True love. Twin flame. Ooh, Taurus. Queen of Pentacles. Someone who's abundant, giving, loving, motherly. And this relationship could be a Leo. Mm -hmm. But to me, it seems like this is a Sagittarius and a Leo to me. Mm -hmm. Two people that was given to each other and somebody betrayed each other in this. Caused the breakup is what I'm seeing in here. So, you know, I like to clarify my cards. I like to... I can't be clarifying other people's cards because this ain't my energy. This ain't my shit. My shit is in here. My energy is in here. This is what I connect with spirit with. My energy ain't in these. But, I mean, I mean, I can jump in them, yeah, and, you know, but I, I like my cards. I pick up more with them. I can state more. I know more with my cards. But anyway, we're going, we, we going, I'm learning how to use these and these together. You know what I mean? So, I will be good, y'all. Don't worry, I got you. Anyway, what I see in this picture is the Sagittarius, and I see the Leo. Like I said, I had already spoke about the Sagittarius. Sagittarius here, wanting to come back. They are the ones that bit that hand. That tongue is out. And they bit the damn Sagittarius. I mean, the uh, yeah, yeah, the Sagittarius hand. Or vice versa. The Leo is the one that broke up with the Sagittarius because they bit the hand. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This shit was grounded, stable. A lot of money came in this house. Mm, but there was passion somewhere else. I already said that. Mm -hmm. How I know, because there's another little baby little Leo up in there. And it's like you see like something else, like another one. Somebody else that they were compatible with, passionate with. Could be Scorpio. Could be a Gemini. Oh, the person they were compatible with was a Virgo or a Gemini. This, this, uh, 
this Leo. Mm, barely compatible with the letter that. Yeah, they were compassionate with somebody. You want to get more, y'all. Mm -hmm. It was compassionate, it could be, but it, they, oh, it was a Taurus. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Oh, here's the Virgo right here. Duh, duh. Damn. I said that too. This is who they were compatible with. Sag. For some of y'all, this is to a Sag. Mm. Yep, they was given to this person. And bit the hand that fed the ass. Could have been giving it up to someone else. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I guess it's the person that was in that third party. Mm -hmm. Now, you know, we got the Knight of Pentacles, someone reliable, authentic, trustworthy. This, this person... Dependable, reliable, authentic, trustworthy. Oh shit, this is the person you trusted. Yup, 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 yup. This is the person you trusted. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yup, yup, yup. You thought this person was being faithful to you. This person is the... Alright, let me... Y'all better catch these re... Y'all better catch this, because I'm about to just start running with this. You're going to have to catch it. But this Sagittarius here is a white snake. She was faithful, brave, brave through this. She got her fucking hand bit off, yo. With the trust and the honesty behind her back. I'm telling you, this Knight of Pentacles was supposed to be trustworthy. She trusted this person because they were reliable, authentic. They were dependable, practical. practical. Oh, oh, he ain't nowhere. He just down there at the bar somewhere. He ain't going nowhere far. Just real practical. Had no idea. His ass is over here making another fucking offer to this fucking Queen of Pentacles. While she over here taking care of his ass. This Sagittarius right here. Vice versa, y'all take the energy as it resonates. It could be a Leo. Mm, it might be. It's the Leo. This Leo. Because we saw Sagittarius saying, I miss you. I love you to death. Will you ever talk to me? Will you ever? Yeah. Y'all take this energy as it resonates. All I know is I ain't got Tommy trying to figure out who just what. I just know that this these energies is the ones that are in this story. Get, look, catch this T. This is what's going on. Yeah. Yeah, I think the Sagittarius may be out. Or I don't know for some of y'all. It's both y'all. Y'all both are Sagittarius. One of y'all is out and one of y'all is in. One of y'all got Leo and your goddamn sign. One of y'all got Virgo and Gemini and your goddamn sign. Take the energy as it resonates. Y'all getting me confused now. I'm losing my goddamn story trying to keep up with this. Yeah, because there's a lot of goddamn bunch of y'all out here. Anyway, someone. Anyway. Let me find out if, if she found out about this. And that's what made her. That was the last goddamn hand that bit the goddamn. That was the last damn hand. Y'all know what I mean. The last straw that broke the camel's back. That last hand that bit. Somebody was digging other people, young, old, in and out. All I mean, this woman was trusting shit. Somebody was trusting what their person said. Because they were so compatible. This Leo right here. On what they was talking about. Like this goddess, this Virgo is who broke, could have broke up. 
Who could have? Some spirit was sent? I don't know. But someone decided that they was going to go ahead and take action towards this person. Mm. Somebody young. Could be at work. Yeah, you trusted this person to be at work and out there making that money. Yeah, that's what it is. Mm-hmm. Because he went from a knight to a page. But what he was doing behind your back while you were here thinking that he was at work, he was out here at work making other offers to other people. Mm-hmm. This chariot over here was going towards somebody else. He was going towards somewhere else. Somebody he felt compatible with. Somebody outside of his house he was going with. I'm telling you right now. I said a Scorpio. Could be an Aquarius. Could be a Taurus. Or could be a Leo. Somebody in this damn cycle, he was going, this cancer, he could be a cancer. He was going somewhere, it, it, I'm telling you. Somebody was going some damn where, and this is a Sagittarius right here. Somebody closed out a cycle with Sagittarius. They either going, I'm telling you, mm -mm -mm. I'm telling you, look at this white snake. Look at this white S right there. That Someone, this Scorpio is a white snake. Some one of these people, this person was running towards, and this person, I don't know, must have found out. I think this person knew what this person was doing behind this person's back and left this person, closed out a cycle. Somebody is Sagittarius, or somebody could have closed out a cycle with a Scorpio, Aquarius, a Taurus, or a Leo. They moved forward, and this person got cancer in their damn chart, is what I'm seeing here. Because this is about completions. Endings, new start, and new love is what I'm seeing here. Somebody close a cycle mm, with the hangman here. Yeah, they no longer wanted to hold on to this. <clears throat> I feel like someone no longer had the strength to hold on to it. Someone listened to spirit with the common sense right here. Someone. Someone listen to spirit here with the common sense, yeah. And with the hangman, someone became closed off. Felt like they was wasting time with this person. Moved on, closed out the cycle with this person. Didn't want to be with this person anymore. Didn't see the value in this person anymore. Mm-hmm. Grew impatient. There was some indecision. Mm-hmm. Something they got the involved, I mean, got themselves involved into. Somebody got themselves involved into somebody else that they was given to. And someone found out that they got their hand bit. Uh-huh. And found out they was over here. They trusted this person. They thought they were dependable, reliable. When they found out they asses over here giving to somebody else, they took the fuck off and closed out this cycle with some fucking body. Oh, they had unconditional love for this person. They were faithful to this goddamn person. I told you they was over here. They was loving. They was over here at work. They had no goddamn idea. Uh-huh. They was real confident. They was, I mean, they had that money and everything. They was real spiritual. You see this eight up underneath here. They spiritual. I'm telling you, for some of y'all, I'm telling you right now, whoever you was messing with, they had Scorpio and they got them chart. Mm-hmm. Or Sag. A Sag could be a white snake. She holding those two white sticks. I get white snake. Uh-huh, whatever it was, this was a painful this was a painful ending. Someone took action. This is the goddamn action that someone was taking. Because someone was out here charming someone goddamn else. So this cancer was done took action because this goddamn Gemini was over here giving to a goddamn the damn Virgo. Mm, and that was this last fucking straw. Got on her fucking nerves. His fucking nerves, her fucking nerves. Spirit told they ass that was it. 
They close out that goddamn same cross. They close out that same cycle. And got the hell out of here. This was a twin flame. Because this, I'm telling you. This devil, I keep seeing twin flames over here. I see those two ribbons right here. I keep seeing it. Somebody was over here collaborating. And this was at work. These three pinnacles, somebody was working with some goddamn body. At work, behind somebody's goddamn back. That's exactly what they were doing. They was coming in every day, going to work. Hey, baby, how was your day? You hungry? Let me feed you, honey. Let me do this. Let me do this. I mean, they was up in here doing the most. Because this was their man. They wanted to take care of their ass. Mm-hmm. Packed his motherfucking lunch for his motherfucking ass and sent his ass on each and every fucking day. That motherfucker come back and was given love and abundant, nurturing, motherly. And all behind your back. Every time you turn your damn back, this damn man supposed to be at work. Mm-hmm. I'm telling you. This how I know. Look, look at this green. Look at this green behind her goddamn back. Look at his ass with this damn green on. His ass supposed to have been at work. His ass supposed to have his damn, damn ass at work. Look her. He over here every day, every day, every day. Going to work, going to work, going to work. You know what I mean? He out here and shit, you know, going to work. Look her ass. She over here thinking he at work, he at work, he at work. Look, behind her motherfucking back. Look, he got her thinking that he at work, he at work, he at work. Now thinking... Her, this one with this damn red on. The one with the red on. Thinking, this one. Got her ass thinking his ass is at fucking work making that goddamn money. Uh-uh. She fucking found out that his ass ain't making that goddamn money. His ass is out here doing something motherfucking else. Whatever the fuck his ass was doing, she took the fuck off in this goddamn situation. This motherfucker's over here in regret. Can I talk to you? Will you ever forgive me? Whatever the fuck this motherfucker was doing over here with this goddamn money. Say right now, she took the she took the fuck off. That goddamn sheets can come off that motherfucking bed fast enough before she got the fuck up out of there. Yes, say right now, the decorations off the goddamn Christmas tree in the front door couldn't come off fast enough before she got the fuck up out of that goddamn thing. Cause she was pissed when she found out that her lover was over here fucking somebody else. This woman is naked. This is why she closed out the cycle. She found out her motherfucking man be, was not at work. You see what's behind her now? She found them sheets. She thought his motherfucking ass was over here fucking working. Down here making shit stable for her motherfucking ass. Keep giving to this goddamn house. She loved it. Look all these roses every goddamn way. Mm-hmm. Now when she fucking find out, look at she done found out. This is her. Her closing out them goddamn cycles. Whatever lied about that goddamn money. Close out the shit about him lying about the belly. Look, this is her. This is you. You done found out that damn... This shit was a lie. That fucking green done went blue. This motherfucker was not at work working like the fuck he said. Look, you over here holding like, where the fuck was you at? Like, 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 like these uh flashlights. Like, like, you didn't know where the fuck he was at. You over here thinking he was at goddamn work. And look, now you got the goddamn flashlights. Don't know where the fuck he was at. I'm telling you, this was a damn Scorpio. Mm, for some of y'all, y'all are the Scorpio. I found talking talk about y'all person. It's Earth person. Earth, Earth, Earth. Pentacle, Pentacle, Pentacle. Fire sign. Earth fire is over here. This is could be that person. Earth fire. Uh huh. This Earth fire sign could have been the one. I got Earth right here. I got fire right here. Somebody wasn't using their goddamn intuition. Somebody was over here compatible, working together, cooperating with the goddamn each other while he was at work. Somebody find out about that shit. Missed them goddamn red flags and took the fuck off. Spirit done told they ass, get the hell up out of here, and they gonna go. They took off. Took took the fuck off. This could be an Aquarius. Mm -hmm. Because they found out they ass was out here in the street. The damn lady ain't got no bra. None of that shit. Look, she found out. I'm telling you. And took the fuck off because of what her person did. So for this story here, this is the reason why someone's twin flame journey. This is someone's twin flame journey. This is the beginning of a twin flame journey for someone. As to why they are now who they are. Mm -mm. This is someone's journey right here. Here's your journey. And this is the beginning. This is the end to a new beginning. Here we go. Hell yeah. Because this is what made you close out the cycle. This is why your person is coming back. It's, uh, man, man. 
close out that goddamn cycle. So now here we go, part two on as this fucking cycle turns, as the world turns. Here we go right here on as this world turns. This this person, they done got on their last goddamn nerve. We don't already saw it. Let's go recap. We already saw it. This shit was a painful fucking ending for somebody to see that they goddamn person was out here in the fucking streets fucking somebody else. Had to be painful. The red right here, they love her. Unconditional love. This shit was a knot. This motherfucker loved they fucking ass. Tell you would have gave them the world. Done anything for them. Gave them any motherfucking thing. There wasn't another motherfucking body around that compared to this motherfucking body. Ain't see no motherfucker. Ain't see these motherfuckers. All she saw was her one. The fuck? And to find out behind her goddamn back, she see this motherfucker over here giving this on. She took the fuck off. Closed out this goddamn cycle with this motherfucker and said, fuck you. Look, the fuck? <clears throat> now this motherfucker was out here fucking somebody with the letter T. Spirit helped her. You know, out. <clears throat> Yeah, he told you, use your goddamn common sense. Blind man. He said a blind man can see what the fuck happened here. A blind man can see this shit. But your damn person was doing over here behind your goddamn back. Giving to somebody else. So you walked that fucking ass away. Told that motherfucker, fuck you. You left all this shit he was coming, all this stability, him working each and every day. You taking care of his ass, the stability pouring into this goddamn family, making sure he had his fucking lunch, goddamn shirts iron, motherfucking damn, took a shower, took a goddamn, I mean, you goddamn his fucking mama. So what the hell, honestly, damn, they were taking care of his ass, every goddamn thing you were doing for this motherfucker, every goddamn thing. After you find out about that fucking secret, you got the fuck on. You took, you got the fuck on. And left this goddamn family. Left every motherfucking thing that you poured into it. Every goddamn sheet. Every goddamn cooking utensil. Every fucking thing. The goddamn Christmas tree. There's no... This shit ain't no... Ain't no sunshine when she's gone. Doom, doom, doom. You took the fuck off. That's what the fuck happened. Because of this goddamn betrayal. Look at that. One, two, three. And healed yourself. Don't tell me spirit don't be in here. And you healed yourself. That's where you went. That's where the hell you went. Because I was wondering where the hell are you going. This why your ass left. So let's move on ahead. Yep. Because that motherfucker lied and didn't tell you the goddamn truth. You wanted to know what the hell was going on at work. This motherfucker did was supposed to be at work. His ass went over at work. This is why y'all broke up. You found out about the goddamn lie and walked away. He was always messing around. He was always messing around. And determined. And I mean, you want, and for some of you, you want the goddamn truth. Y'all was standing strong. This motherfucker needed to be courageous when it was time to bring that goddamn truth into you. Didn't want to give you the goddamn truth. Was dishonest. Didn't have the strength. Didn't have the courage. That's how I know for some of y'all, this person is Leo. Didn't have the courage. Didn't have the strength to bring you the goddamn truth. Wasn't confident enough. Wasn't determined enough. But your ass was intuitive enough to know what your person was doing. You was so goddamn ambitious to find out what the hell was going on over here. So focused. You was going to focus. You want to know who the fuck was he fucking with. You were focused like a motherfucker. Thinking about who the fuck was he fucking with at work. Yes, yes, she was. Fucking with a Gemini. Cancer. Cancer and Gemini. Could have been in his story fucking around at work. Somebody wanted to know. <laughs> Somebody. This Scorpio, this Aquarius, this Leo, Taurus wanted to know. For some of y'all, I'm switching over. These are all the energies. Hey, y'all better come on, keep up with it. But anyway, like I said, you walk the fuck away. Mm-hmm. Show sure did got the fuck out of there and left because you didn't get the goddamn truth. And when you finally did whatever it was, you, I, I don't think so because these swords are still down. You went on ahead and you left. You fucking left. You left on your own. This shit is what caused this damn change, what caused this goddamn breakup. You didn't get the truth. You left this fucking family. Breakup. Left. Single. Ghosted a motherfucker. Someone was ghosted. For some of you, you ghosted this motherfucker. <laughs> I have a damn shame. Yep. 
because they lied. Now somebody wanted to come and tell the truth. Now this motherfucker might be trying to take action. Then I say somebody trying to take action. Could be this Leo at this painful ass motherfucking ending. Probably this Gemini with the Leo or this Leo with the Gemini that they was given to. That they was being charming, going out with this motherfucker all in their goddamn car. They must have had a fancy, nice-ass motherfucking car being all gentle and nice and all enthusiastic and shit. Driving this bitch all around goddamn town and was deceiving your ass. In this motherfucking family, in this goddamn marriage, in this relationship. Whatever it was, somebody needed to bring to you some goddamn truth and honesty in this goddamn situation. Uh-huh. Because I believe someone may have stolen some money. That's what the fuck the karma came back to your person was. Someone secretly stole their goddamn money. That goddamn queen of pentacles who was focusing only on a goddamn money on her back. She wasn't focusing on no goddamn love in this goddamn situation. I see not a near motherfucking love car. And that's probably the fucking karma that came back. Since your ass was sat here and run around with all these. Could have been Aquarius. Could have been um, uh, a Scorpio. Uh, Taurus or, or I mean Leo or Taurus y'all know what I mean I'm telling you right now the, 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 hell for some of y'all it could have been a goddamn Sagittarius that betrayed one of y'all out, out the, in this circle mm-hmm that's what I pick up too they didn't give you the truth in this matter yup 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 yes I do didn't bring you the truth <clears throat> yup Mm-hmm. Hell yeah, holding back and shit. Unhappy as fuck now that you done close out this cycle. Mm. For some of y'all, y'all unhappy, y'all had to that this person because this person lied. If you know it look, lie, truth, honesty, truth, honesty. I don't see you getting it. You moving on, having to close out this cycle. You wasn't happy with having to do this. We're having to leave your fucking family, your stability, what you worked so hard on. You prayed, you meditated, you waited, but after what you found out, shit, your ass went left on a motherfucker. Mm-hmm. That's exactly what you did. You went left. You went damn left. You said the fuck out of here. That's what somebody did. I'm telling you. She wasn't happy. Somebody wasn't happy. But somebody should have came in. You cut their ass off because they didn't bring you the truth. Told you you wasn't happy with having to cut their ass off. But you had to do what the hell you had to do. You had already meditated, waited long enough. You had already, well, and went single. You damn sure did. Yes, you did. Mm-hmm. Started worrying about yourself, taking care of yourself, looking out for yourself, said fuck everybody. And you just listened to spirit. You sure did. With that bird right here, you ain't, wanna, you ain't talk to nobody. You just focus on you and your money. This could be a Taurus. This could be a Capricorn or Virgo. Mm -hmm. who may have cut off could be an Aquarius mm -hmm. Queen Queen of Swords could be Aquarius Lim Libra or Gemini this is a Gemini card right here take the energy as it resonates it could be vice versa hell yeah so y'all could be a Sagittarius that did this because of a Taurus and a, um, I mean because of an earth sign and an air sign but I don't get that I feel like somebody cut somebody off somebody went single after they find out about this heartbreak Hell yeah. Somebody definitely went single after they found out. And now someone's wanting to be forgiven. Someone wants to come in and... Someone want, want to be forgiven for lying to you. Mm-hmm. How about for causing this goddamn breakup? That's what it is. Someone wants to come in. That's why they already said... We already saw some cards saying, Will you ever talk to me? Will you ever forgive me? This is them asking you, will you ever forgive me about this fucking third party about they did? Y'all, look, this is y'all. Look, rejecting they ass. Tell you right now, y'all done rejected they ass. Y'all separated. You ain't talking. This is someone who's needing to make things right. This is someone who's nitpicking. Mm-hmm. About this shit. Somebody with the letter M in their name. Telling y'all, both y'all got a letter M in y'all name. Both y'all could be married. One could be widowed. One could have, I don't know. What the, I don't know. Separated? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We got the widow. We got the ghost. But I don't know. For some of y'all, maybe it is. For a small percentage, maybe it is. Could have ended. Killed it. Killed this relationship. Widow. Killed it. Ended it. By themselves. Single. 
when they was once together with a twin, a divine. Both of these are two M's. Somebody went and ran off. Could have been for money. I see all these goddamn pentacles. I see this green M. Winnings, money. I don't know. Take the energy as it resonates. But all I know is somebody's wanting to be forgiven now. Somebody's wanting to be accepted after they came in and they lied. They know. This was severe. They lied hard. This was a severe, severe, severe. I'm telling you. This was very, this was, this was. Uh, I don't know. Not wanting to see the fucking truth. Disastrous. So what the fuck I see here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This shit was disastrous. Whatever the fuck I said, this shit was some shit. They and look at them in reverse. Needing forgiveness and shit. Whatever the hell they did, they were depressed. They lost hope. Someone was let go. Uh, we already knew that. And we keep moving forward. Ain't no point to keep talking about that. Now they're watching you. Probably want to come in and apologize. I, we already said that. You done moved on. You guys done moved away from them asses. After they deceived your ass, it was done. You done took whatever the fuck you had, put your shit in the goddamn boat. You ain't give a fuck if that motherfucker would sink. You would swim just to get away from this motherfucker because you did not. You was holding back. You didn't want this motherfucker at all. They better not even come near your ass. The way you watching this motherfucker, you got the clarity. Motherfuckers is gossiping about this shit, talking about this shit. You don't want a motherfucking thing to do with this motherfucker right here because this is the one that you were socializing with. This is the one that you should have used your intuition with. This is what you were too busy having fun with this motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Dreaming. Dreaming. It's that motherfucker that caused that unexpected fucking mishap here. Just kept fucking knight of cups. Somebody now wants to fucking own up, boss up now from a page of swords to the knight of cups. Now they want to come in with some emotions and shit. This dreamer, they still... They, somebody saying in your fucking dreams. They want to come in and make some fucking offer. Some type of proposal they want to make. They want to bring something in real fast, real quick. I see a lot of swords here. They probably think that you don't want them. They you they're thinking you don't want you don't want them to come towards you because they they've lied and they cheated. You probably thinking anything that, that they got to say or that they come in come uh 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 come in and say is not gonna be a truth and honesty. Whatever it is that they're trying to offer, you don't think it's gonna be legit. Mm-hmm. Because of them goddamn third parties in the past. You don't feel like they like they've actually let this go. Cause this is what caused this betrayal. This disloyalty in the family. That third party. Whoever it was they was given with. And this shit's coming in around Halloween. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you think they always gonna be this way to keep you in these competitions with these chaotic people and they families are chaotic. For some of y'all, y'all just don't want to deal with they family in them. You feel like they too toxic. They too chaotic. You just want to, like, keep your guard up, move forward, start all over again, meet someone new. You're not beat. Yeah, you cutting off anybody that's, all, like, don't serve you. Anybody that's coming in, like, not, I mean, with toxic ways and not healing and you just not beat you just not trying to hear it you don't want no chaos in your life you want someone who's compatible with you and you hope in spirit send you that someone who's just as determined someone who's honest someone who, who's going to be courageous stand up for you who's going to be confident not weak for any fucking thing that they see any goddess that come by looking good charming outgoing and gentle with their ass and them thinking that this is going to be their new true love and then start showing them all this goddamn passion and then when they get hurt in a fucking in, in a situation they get some the bitch take off on their ass they fucking get this heartbreak and then want to take action and come down towards you and want to offer you a bunch of bullshit that's why y'all like no i'm tired of dealing with this you gonna be putting me in this competition look you can't make me number one then look i'm cutting you off straight up and down I just said, if you ain't gonna make me number one, then I'm cutting you off straight up and down. That's what I said. That's why you're not giving them this new start. You out here, if you ain't gonna, look, if you ain't gonna do it, you got to let go of all these others. You've been having all these passionate, a lot of motherfuckers, you was over here fucking. 
Mm -hmm. All these false starts. You scared. Because of all this shit that they've done in the past. They've done this before. Say they're going to give you, give you, give you, give you. Look how tall that wine is. Oh, yeah, I'm going to do right. I'm going to do right. I'm going to do right. I'll be damned. Where? I don't see them doing right right here with the Ace of Wands in reverse. No, they, they neglected you. Wasted time. Took you for granted. This is why you don't want their ass. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. When it comes to this family. But they want happiness, stability with you. Fulfillment. They feel fulfilled with you since you've been gone. They know. They want They want your forgiveness. They know they lied and cheated. They betrayed you. You're their goddess. Mm-hmm. They praying to God. God, I just tell you. Praying to God to get you back. Praying to God you'll listen to them. Praying to God you'll hear them out in this situation. They're praying to God. Mm -hmm. But this like they want to they want to come into you, talk talk to you. They want to know will you ever talk to them? Will you talk to me? In the meantime, they watch you like a goddamn hawk because you ain't talking to them. You ain't looking at them in the right light anymore. You don't see them the goddamn same. That's because they was over here. Look at them with this wand. Look at them right here. But you ended it. Look at what they've done. They want forgiveness. Someone wants to know, will you forgive me? Please forgive me. Please forgive me. Please forgive me. Who the hell is that at the door? Your person coming to the goddamn door. I'm going to tell you that right now. You may not even open the door. That's why it's in fucking reverse. Who is that? What are you doing? Oh, all right. I'm telling you, somebody coming to the goddamn door. I'm telling you right now. This is someone who's stuck in the past who needs forgiveness. For you guys, you guys are stuck in the past as to what this person did to you. And you're not forgiving them. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I already said this was someone who was together for a minute. A long time. I said that already. Yep. You don't feel it's worth it. You don't feel it's going to be successful. You don't feel you're going to get anywhere with this person. Ooh, you sure don't. Yep, yep, yep. The Empress. Wow. So now what's going on? So the Empress is saying she's done with this shit. Anything that don't serve her now the spirit came into her life. She, she don't want nobody who's not here. If you... If you're here for a good time and not a long time, stay the fuck out of her goddamn life. She don't want your ass. She wants someone who's going to be faithful. And mind you, she's highly intuitive, so she damn sure going to pick up when your ass ain't no goddamn good. Don't think you're going to charm her out of her goddamn drawers with all your enthusiastic fucking ways, passionate goddamn ways. She ain't hearing that shit because she got spirit now. She done got, I'm telling you, this damn woman done healed. Look at her. Bitch is looking beautiful than a motherfucker. Pretty as hell. Mm -mm. Pretty wings. That's what I get when I see this. Mm -hmm. Dog is singing. Me and a dog is singing to the damn bitch. Now you know a bitch gotta be bad when you and your goddamn animals sing. So, man, huh? Look at her. She ain't taking no nothing. No nothing. Look at her. She not, she, she not with all that love shit. Bitch is working on herself. Starting all over again. Here's a Leo right here. Dumb. Somebody left this Leo. Left this love. Someone left. Could be this earth sign. It was this goddamn earth sign that left. It's Virgo. What I feel, they got Virgo in their goddamn chart. This Virgo is the one that left. I'm telling you, it's her. I'm telling you, she left. They start working on her own. This Ace of Cups is gone. She started doing her. She took a look. Look, the sun is behind her ass. That Leo. Mm -hmm. That one somebody was given. She left that Leo. She don't got no love for this goddamn Leo. She decided to close out the cycle with this goddamn Leo and don't move forward in the situation because she didn't see it working. She, this motherfucker was disloyal. This motherfucker was over here having his cake and eating it too. She said, hell to the no, 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 and dropped that fucking love. Listen to what fucking spirit told her. She dropped that love. Listen to the real love. Jesus. God loves you. Spirit told her who loves her. And she damn sure listen. That's why she is who she is. Look. Look what happened. She left that shit. This shit was a destruction. Tower moment. This shit was fucking chaos. Destruction. She walked away from it all. 
This shit was sudden, shocking, and eye-opener. After that bitch opened up that goddamn third eye, shit, she fucking, look, left. Spirit, look, her ass left this shit. I'm telling you right now. Hmm. And now look at her goddamn crown. Don't tell me nothing. Don't tell me a goddamn thing. Hell yeah, this was heartache, pain, stress, health problems. Look how clean, look how good she looked now. Look, I mean, look, look, her fucking crown and shit. Look at that bitch. That's a bad bitch right here to go from here. Come on, now this bitch transformed and came up. This, some of y'all, y'all are the white snake. You do have Scorpio in your chart. I'm telling you right here, because he got a white goddamn snake right here with that water right here. I just said it. Just said it. Because the bitch, you highly intuitive. You already knew because spirit showed you. Spirit showed you. Showed you. Look, showed you what the hell was going to go on inside this damn situation. I'm telling you, for some of y'all, y'all saw it, chaos. For some of y'all, after that, y'all saw this chaos. This is what the hell, why y'all don't want to go back to this person. Why y'all feel like y'all better off, stable, abundant, fulfilling on your goddamn own. Uh-huh. Yup. It comes to love. Look at this shit. This fucking heart. This heart of stone right here. This bitch is single, independent, and every goddamn thing. That's why I said this motherfucker was, where is that at? I could have sworn I saw so I forgot. I maybe it's in somewhere. I don't know. But anyway, that's what she is. This is her. This is her. All that housewifey shit. That bitch went on ahead of me. She gave to herself. Took this leap of faith. <clears throat> Spirit showed her ass. I was like, don't you worry. I got you. And sure enough did. Carried her along the way. Look at her. Now look at her. Look at her by listening to Spirit. Look, look, look. Getting that goddamn knowledge that she needed. To close out this motherfucking cycle with whatever karmic will her ass was on. I already told y'all. Somebody can have a letter L in this karmic cycle. Somebody can have the letter G. Somebody can have the letter S. Somebody can have the letter I T N O. A U R O L. But that's what happened. Yes, she did. Yes, she did. Mm hmm. Yes, she did. Yes, she did. Now that goddamn Leo or, or Aries or whomever, this boss is no longer in control. Someone is no longer in control of this situation. They can no longer over control, overtake, overrule, overpower anybody in this damn situation. Your person cannot do that any goddamn more. And they probably fucking mad that they can't do it. That they can't control you anymore. This motherfucker was, was confused with who the fucking enemy was and who wasn't. You were never their fucking enemy. And that's what the fuck they thought. You were their fucking enemy, always taking action. You was always compatible, always showed them fucking love. And this motherfucker was over here, I don't know. But whatever it was, it was on your last goddamn nerve. And you broke up. This has been your reading collective. If this is resonating, please like, share, and subscribe. I love you so much. Take care and good night.